Hey guys, I'm Jace from Digital Trends. Uh, we're going to be talking about Bitcoin today and specifically how to mine Bitcoin. Um, this is Jake, our resident uh, Bitcoin and cryptocurrency mining enthusiast. Yes, enthusiast, not an expert, not an expert. <laughs> so, so tell us a little bit about how uh, cryptocurrency mining works before, before we get started. Well, you use a processor and for Bitcoin and cryptocurrency mining, it gets very specific what type of processor. It's not your CPU, it's most likely your GPU. And there's even specific ASIC mining processors that are designed just to mine cryptocurrency, which is kind of the three main platforms that you could have mined crypto. Okay, so, so basically you can do this on pretty much any computer, right? You could, including this laptop that we have in front of us. It's surprisingly easy for anyone with a PC to mine Bitcoin. The first thing you'll need to do is join a mining pool. There are a variety of them out there like Slush Pool, Z Pool, Mining Pool Hub, and NiceHash. We're going with NiceHash and they're going to give us the mining software to download. We're just using the CPU to mine on this laptop, so we'll choose the newer NVIDIA version of the software. Next, we connect our Bitcoin wallet provided by NiceHash to collect all the money we're about to make. Now we're up and mining. So you've seen the time lapse. We've been running this laptop mining Bitcoin for a few days. How much have we earned? We've earned about eight cents a day. Woo! Making it rain! So eight cents a day, we're never gonna make a million dollars. Like how long would it take you to make a million dollars if we just left this thing running? If the price of Bitcoin stayed steady where it is right now, it would take us about 34,000 years. 34,000 years, chase. So, I'm not gonna live that long. I need to get Bitcoin faster than that. Can I add more computers to our little mining pool here to cut that down? You can actually. So the more computers you have in your mining pool, the faster things are gonna okay, go. Okay, I'm gonna add this Apple laptop. 34,000 years cut down to what? Is it gonna be eight cents a day? Or are we talking, can we go to 12 well, cents a day with this? Every one of these laptops is gonna run a little bit differently depending okay. on their hardware. This has an internal graphics card and uh, an integrated graphics card. So it's gonna get a little bit more, okay. but not by a lot. So maybe 20 cents a day. Maybe 20 cents a day. Okay, more laptops, Surface Book Pro, Dell 4. We're gonna have a pool here. Maybe in our lifetime? We can see if we can get it down there. All right, let's get these set up in mining. So we've got all four laptops up and mining and we're making about 76 cents a day. Yeah. So that takes us from 34,000 years on the one laptop down to how long? Only about 3,600 years. Shoot dang, my granddaughter's 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 granddaughter might actually see those million dollars. But in the end, April fools, because the last Bitcoin will be mined when? In 2140. So by the time that we've even mined, maybe even a couple thousand dollars, Bitcoin will have seen its last days mining and it will just be processing fees from there on out. So don't rely on a laptop to make a million dollars.